What's up YouTube, back at the Gang Gabriel's Kicks with another new unboxing. Shout out to all my new subscribers, shout out to all my old subscribers and my loyal subscribers out there. Um, Happy New Year's to you all. Today is gonna be my 2018th pickup. This is not my first pickup. I have three 2018 pickups that I purchased early this January. The one of the early release, I was lucky to win them from the Nike app. That's a hint right there. Another hint, they came out last week in the Nike app on the 26th of January. You can't guess what they are, the Black Cement 3s. Uh, last week, Nike notified me and uh, J23, you guys gotta download that app, J23. Um, notified me as well, shout out to both of them notify me that they're doing a early release, logged on in a couple of seconds and said I got them. And I was blessed to grab these babies. Excited to see these and these are actually uh, one of my first uh, Jordan Cement 3s with the Nike swoosh on the back instead of the, the Jumpman because I do want a pair of the ones, uh, the 2013 version with the heel on the back of the Jumpman. But let's pretty much get into this. These are legit Nike app. Uh, here's my order. Receipt from Nike. Let you know, this is straight from the Nike app. And wow, let's get into this. Wow. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. I am so excited. Nine and a half. Right there. Colorway is black, fire red, cement gray. This, wow. Nothing special behind the box, just red, just in case you want to see. Check the inside. Got that elephant print on the paper. Wow, <laughs> we'll take both of them out. Wow, look at these. Oh, they smell so good. Real quick review. I mean, you guys seen these numerous times. I mean, they nothing really changed in this, just looking at them in person. You basically got your you know, black cement colorway, traditional colorway. Uh, the leather quality is really nice. I'm telling you, I was expecting the leather quality to be like to the true blues. And wow, I, I, I kid you not, you guys could see this. The leather quality is really nice. I really can't compare the leather quality to any other sneaker, just that this actually feels better than the 2013 version. If you guys had the 2013 version, it has the Jumpman in the back. And you guys, when you get these, I guess you guys can make your own opinion because these, the leather quality, as you can see, is soft and really nice. It's not rough like the true blues were. And it's really soft. As you can see, it's not too durable like the true blues. These are really, really soft, I mean. If you're gonna play with these in the courts, I, I, I would recommend some ankle protection because these things are really, really soft. Side panel all in black with that black leather. Also below the ankle or the side panel, got gotcha, a touch of uh, elephant print, got gotcha, a touch of black there and gray. As you can see below the side panel right here, got a more of touch of black. This this actually feels like pleather. This right here is probably like the only thing that's not a soft material. It's kind of rugged. You guys can see it up close. So I got that rugged pleather feeling. Got more of that traditional elephant print on the side all in uh, 
black and gray toe box right here got more of that elephant print black and gray with that touch of uh, pleather above the elephant print more of that uh, real good soft leather above the toe box same thing on the side on the other side of the sneaker midsole black white throughout the whole entire sneaker got your air unit on the side pretty much nothing changed i like how they kept the traditional um, colors and traditional style like the 2001 version the eyelids are in red on the side it's all in gray got your perforations got your black eyelids moving through the back of the sneaker that infamous iconic nike air on the back of the heel as you can see you got your pull tab and what's cool you got more perforations right here on the side as well also behind the pull tab right here more of that perforations as you can see but that infamous iconic nike air this is what pe this is what make people go crazy is that elephant print got your touch of black white and gray lace units right here got your jump man on the tongue in red with a touch of gray your lining above the tongue is in red uh, got gotcha. your Keychain on the side that says Nike Air. Inside of the interior, you got that gray. You guys can see that behind the tongue. Got that red. Inside of the insole, you can see it's in red and the word inscription of Nike Air is in black. Bottom of the soles, got your simple gray and red. Instead of this being uh, said Jordan, it says Nike. You guys can see it says Nike. Stars on the toe of the sneakers, if you can see that. I don't see no flaws or no peaks on these, so Actually, that is really good because I remember I purchased a pair of true blues I wound up returning them because of uh, the elephant print behind the heel was all messed up and these are in great condition That's pretty much it and I hope everyone gets a chance to pick these up on February the 17th retail price will be 200 and I hope everyone gets a pair I'm telling you I hope everyone gets a pair cop two pair of you guys get a chance so that's basically it i hope you guys enjoyed this video like and subscribe and give that thumbs up also hit that bell button over here to alert you for all my latest new videos um i got also three boxes of new kicks that are on the way with a, with a new video coming soon so keep a lookout for those uh three uh sneaker pickups Two is from StockX, and, a, and another one is a limited uh, from a Nike app as well. Um, that's basically it. I'm Gabriel's Kicks, 23. Uh, no drinking and driving, no texting and driving. And I'm out. Peace.